It's been a while since I last experimented with UHF data transmitter modules. More recently, I've been experimenting with the companion UHF data receiver modules. I was able to get good performance, but only if the transmitting mode was AM. That's a bit of a mismatch to what I got with the transmitter module, where I was able to transmit good quality FM, but not good quality AM. To see if we could get AM, I hooked up this LM386 audio amplifier module up to a rocking armature microphone. The output from the LM386 stage went into the microphone input of my previous experimental transmitter. I just took off the electric microphone and put in the audio instead. That produced plenty of audio output, in fact too much on FM. But what I found was when I turned this bias control, the output modulation changed. It became more like AM, and I could then receive it on an FT817 set up to AM, as well as on the super regenerative receiver. And then they let me stand on a line, but I tell you, I'm going to keep pushing forward. And, uh... Having the bias at one end completely disables the transmitter. There's a point where it just starts to transmit and at that point we are transmitting AM. Then when we adjust it further then it's only FM being transmitted and you don't hear anything even though I'm talking into the microphone coming out of the AM receiver. One, two, three, four, five, transmitting AM. The setting of this 20k trim pot was fairly critical. I found the quality was best when it was about 1.6 volts on the wiper. Here's something else you might want to look at. For $2 delivered, this is an MP3 player and audio amplifier. You can put your audio medium into this USB socket. Looks like there's a card reader there as well and you're able to get good quality audio coming out of a speaker. That could directly drive a UHF data module and be useful if you wanted an AM beacon or to transmit a pre-recorded message. We're now walking the streets on a cold winter's night to do a range test. Now it's dark, so you're not going to see very much. But at least this video, the sound's more important. This is about 100 metres away. This has been our look at a very basic use of UHF data modules to transmit and receive voice. Together with cheap LM36 audio amplifier modules, you could actually build a very simple UHF 70cm transceiver. As for the range, well, I got about 100 metres outside just with this inside, but if I was to put this on top of a tall mast and pole, then it would be several hundred metres. I'll do that range test in a future video.